Hello! We're back to Halls of Torment, and this time I'm going to be making an Arcane Rift um, build, which is probably my new favorite ability. It's so fun. It's like an auto-bomber build. And for the items, we just take very simple stuff, just a DPS set, attack speed from the crown, and movement speed, attack speed from the guiding star, more attack speed with quick hand gloves. The chest doesn't really matter. The shoes, more movement speed and maiden's tier for a little bit of heal. We need a lot of movement speed and attack speed because that's what's going to scale uh, our build. I did take the Mark of the Beast. Uh, you get this from Agony 3 from the Beast Huntress. This will give my main weapon 15% chance uh, to frost enemies. As well as the Ring of Frost, another 10% chance. And uh, now my main weapon does ice damage. So if you're having uh, difficulty doing the um, the agony mode on the frozen depths, uh, try out this build. Um, it, it, it might be able to get you that that uh, agony three. I'm not gonna go into it though because currently it's just it's so cancer to go into that uh, frozen depths there for agony. Um, so I'm gonna go into level one. And oh, we got so lucky. So we already have arcane. Rift. So the way it works, it will spawn these uh, circles here, and once you step on it, they explode. However, there is an upgrade for this that you can get, where they will move towards you. So we can get a kind of a pseudo auto bomber build going. But I'm gonna make my way down to this ability uh, upgrade here. Honestly, the build is already finished. <laughs> We just have to get the stats. Uh, we're going to go for area, movement speed, and attack speed. Of course, damage in the back, but we just want movement speed and attack speed. Um, and uh, we'll see how that, uh, how far that gets us. I'm hoping for agony level 5, which is the limit. Uh, but I'm going to skip until I get to that ability. Alright, I've just gotten to the ability here. Things are going really well. The um, the archer is just so strong. It's so strong that uh, I don't really have to worry about damage. Um, okay, so the one what we want to go for is Arcane Rift 1 Blast. We will be getting to concentrate one later. Um, but we do want area and damage first. At level 3... We're going to do a little bit of uh, sweaty min-maxing. Because something that you can do... Is that, uh, I've said this a couple of times in some older videos, but in case uh, people haven't watched them. It's that at level 3 and level 6, and I believe now actually level 10, there are traits that are only available during those levels. However, with the memorizing bottle you can actually take two of those abilities um, which you wouldn't be able to do. So, since we're going to be focusing on Arcane Rift, I believe there is an upgrade uh, that gives you damage but lowers your area. But if we use the pot, we will be able to get that area back because there is also an upgrade that gives you area at level 3. So we're going to do a little bit of, uh, you know, uh, min-maxing. It's going to be a little bit uh, sweaty, but that's okay. We want to make a nice build to get us to Agony 5, which we're already a little bit above halfway through with Agony 0 here. As always, I'm not going to pick up uh, this last uh, upgrade here, or ability pickup, because I want level 3 Arcane Rift before I do. So I can guarantee um, the level up. Or, excuse me, the upgrade. So for now, we're just going to chill. Pick up our... Ooh, you know what? Yeah, more damage. Now, one thing that's interesting about the Arcane Rift is that this, this circle, this flat circle, seems to have uh, a max size. So after a certain amount of time, even if you continue to get area up, it doesn't grow. However the actual explosion, that explosion that's happening right there, that does grow. And I believe uh, that's the... There's little splinters. It's, a, it's, a, it's another upgrade. There are little splinters that will come off it. 
and those also grow with area. So we might not be getting these circles to be, you know, full screen circles, but we will be getting uh, the secondary effects to be quite big. Oh, uh, that's multi-strike. I don't really care about that. Um, I'm going to reroll here. Okay, attack speed. Yeah, we're not getting too lucky uh, with our upgrades for Arcane Rift, but that's okay. We just have to keep killing skeletons until we do. We hit Agony 1 already. I, I will take the multi-strike and attack speed. That's going to spawn more, more of them, which means we can proc them faster with the upgrade. Okay, here's a boss. Let's see how fast he dies. Uh, not that fast. Oh, actually, uh, we'll go for area on that one. Yay! Oh! <gasps> okay, I'm actually going to reroll with this. Uh, so these are the uncommon ones, so they have increased stats. What do you give? Attack speed bonus on main weapon. Maximum 30. Oh, but I gotta... No, that's main weapon, and I gotta keep moving, so no. Yes! 40% attack speed. Yes! That's just a direct upgrade. Oh, that was lucky. Beautiful. Alright, that's a, that's a really lucky pickup. I'm happy with that. Uh, let's go more pickup range, I guess. That's faster level ups. But look at this. Like, the archer is so strong. Like, she's killing things that are not even on the screen right now. Uh, we'll go for more frost chance. And that's actually one of the reasons why I took the frost ring on her. Because she can stack frost on all of these people. And when frost hits 20 stacks, it explodes in an AoE. So it's just, it's, it's very good. Crit chance for Kuggle Blitz. I don't quite care about this. Um, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take Dedication for the region and health. I could have rerolled there, but mm, maybe, maybe that was a bad pick. But right now, oh, here's the boss. And look at that multi-hit, it's already coming into play. I got two Kugel Blitz that time. Or Kugel Blitz. I don't know how to pronounce it actually. Uh, base Rift. Okay, I do not want this. This is going to spawn more Rifts, but it's minus 30 area. I, I need the area. I have to reroll here. Uh, Electrified Chance or more Shockwaves. I go more Shockwaves. Uh, I guess I could upgrade Kuggle Blitz if this guy drops an ability, an ability scroll, but yeah, I really need that level 3 upgrade for the Arcane Rift. Movement speed. Mm, although, yeah, movement speed. It's not going to do too much for me right now, but it will once I get the upgrade. Everything depends on that upgrade. Oh my goodness. I'm so happy that they changed this guy. They updated him. Uh, I, yeah. Before the, the level one bosses were kind of boring before. So I'm really, I'm really glad that they, that they reworked them. Oh jeez. Please die. Okay, he dropped, uh, dropped an item. I don't really care about this. I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm gonna skip. I want to re-roll on red chests. I don't know. I don't know this, but I, I'm i assuming that the red chests have a higher chance of having more um, uncommon items. And so I, I do want to re-roll on those. I think having an uncommon wind crown would be pretty GG at that point. I could probably just stand still and kill everything. Which honestly, I could do right now. The only reason that I'm moving around so much is because I want to pick up the uh, the experience. But just standing right now, I'm almost onto Agony 2 within 6 minutes. It is the first level, so it is easier. But I think we're making pretty fast progress. Especially considering we only have 2 abilities. So let's get this stupid slime down. Please drop a red chest. Uh, 
you know what? I'll go for the pickup range. That is just more, more level ups. Yes, he did drop a red chest. Okay, I gotta gamble on it. Uh, you know. Oh, actually, what does this do? Up to 10 random enemies apply in 5D. Yeah, no. No, I didn't get it. Although. No, 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 no. I was gonna... I thought about doing a no auto attack build with this to make this the the rifts deal even more damage. And those gloves wouldn't let me do that since they increase it by 132%. But uh, I don't think I'd do that. So actually, this is a good time to show what I mean by uh, getting two level ups, uh, two unique level ups. So here we have level three occurrence, multi-strike and attack speed, arcane rift three. So I'm going to memorize this. I'm not going to take it. Um, I'll take the attack speed and then now I'm going to reroll fairly heavily because I do want to get the uh, the build going a bit faster here and that upgrade will stay even after I get another level 3 upgrade it will not reset and that way you can get multiple level 3 upgrades or level 6 and 10 if that's what you like to do which it is what I am going to do Ooh, all right. Uh, oh, that's actually really good. Okay, I'll take it. I'll wait one more level. The twenty percent frost damage is going to be useful. I call it frost, but technically it's cold. But I mean, eh, I'm used to saying frost at this point. We are into agony two. Okay, now I can reroll. Mm, there it is. Okay. So this is what I was talking about, right? So I have here three different types of upgrades for level three. So I'm going to, I do want to try the area one. So I'm going to actually double this area one. So that's 60% area. It is going to be minus 30 damage. Uh, so you know what? I think, hmm. So if I do double this, that would be 60% area, and then minus 10, minus 50. Okay, you know what? I think I made a mistake. Um, wait, could I take... No way. Could I take all level 3 upgrades? There is no way it lets me do that, right? <laughs> there is no way! I never tried that. Wait, where's my upgrade? Oh, I got the Kugel Blitz one. Okay, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I forgot that, that Kugel Blitz was at three. Uh, I am going to make my way up to... Oh my god, I think I can. I actually can get all three unique upgrades. Oh, this is going to be so stupid. Oh my goodness. Okay, up. Uh, yeah. Oh no! Okay, I'm gonna make my way up here. Oh, oh Jesus! That movement speed's coming in real handy to getting around these guys. Oh my God! Okay, that time I'm kind of just blocked in. Uh, yes, I can. Oh my Lord! So if I go into my three, 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 yeah, I got all level three upgrades. Huh. I had no idea you could do this. So that, oh no. That's so, that's so good. I'm going to make so many stupid things with that now. Oh, I'm really happy I found that out actually. All right, let's get, let's just kill this idiot. Come on, man. What are you doing? Just die. Actually, drop an ability for me, please. I need more abilities. I need to upgrade. Just drop it, man. Drop it. Oh, you didn't. Okay, this guy should. Yeah, and now it's up to four. So multi-strike damage. No, I don't want that. Um, I don't want any of this. Let me... You know what? I'll take Bulwark. Why not? The Archer is a bit squishy, so I'll just take it. It might come in handy later on once we hit high agony mode. Ooh. 
Pop, 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 pop. Look at all those pops. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't want any of this either. I'm going to have to reroll. You know what? Force is probably going to be duration. That's not too useful. Yeah, it's not too useful. I'm going to reroll. Area and damage. I'll take that. More area, more damage. Yeah, look at that. So the rings, I don't think they're getting any bigger, but that explosion is, which is what we want. Boom. Now, there's also something really interesting that happens. Okay, these are the rift splinters. That's not the one I wanted. Uh, let's go regen. But what I was trying to say is that once you get the upgrade that f that uh, attracts the rifts to you, it seems that you can actually proc them on elite enemies. It might be a bug. I don't know if it is. But elite enemies can actually proc the attack for you. Which is also pretty stupid. <laughs> so... Uh, so this is a very, very good build. It is very fun, and uh, it reminds me a bit of the of the auto bombers in PoE, um, which if you haven't played PoE, I highly recommend it. Um, it does it does take some time to get into because t there's just so much content and so so many things that you can do in that game. But it is so much fun once you actually uh, understand what to do. This is, uh, mm, actually, Concentrate, so it so this one wasn't unique to level 3, so it might have been a mistake to memorize it, but that's okay. Minus 10 to area, I don't really want that, to be honest. Mm, yeah, the damage is nice, but I want to maintain the area, so I'm going to reroll. Uh, I'll take the attack speed, yep. Just more of these. And I'll just keep popping them like so. Uh, movement speed and health, I will take that. Look at this. My goodness. Um, more movement speed, yep. Actually, it would be interesting to see. Hmm... Uh, attack speed. I was thinking. I wonder if you could, since you can, since you can memorize all of those abilities. I wonder if it would be possible to get to agony five with no abilities, just basic attack. You probably could, if you really min maxed it, just sweaty min maxing. I think you might be able to. 40% chance. I might do that actually. I might try to do that. Kill this guy down here. I need another upgrade. Uh, more movement speed. Yep. Oh, he dropped money. That's not what I wanted. No. Don't give me money. Okay, here's six. All right. Uh. Hmm. That is occurrence. Wait, wait a second. We did get occurrence again. Okay, I'm going to memorize this. I might have been wrong, actually. Hmm. Now I'm double guessing myself. I know in the previous build of the game, some of these were were unique to to le to breakpoints at three and six. But two of the ones that I memorized before don't seem to actually be unique. Okay, here it is. So yeah, so the pre I I was right. There, there are still unique uh, level ups, but the ones that I memorized were not. But this one is. Plus one base rift, but minus 30% area. I see. Okay, so I was right. I just, well, I was right about how you can min-max it, but I was wrong about uh, what abilities are actually um, unique to it. So we'll take this another 60% area. Boom. Oh, look at that. 
Oh my god, that's like half the screen. And now that it's level 6, I feel comfortable picking up the ability. The uh, ability scroll. And hopefully we can get the uh, AFK build going. Uh, more area. Yeah, I gotta get some of that area back. That I got a uh, redu reduction from uh, the damage. Damage pickup that I took as well. We need more, more area. More. Uh, more pickup range. Good. That removes it from the pool. Oh my god. That's almost the whole screen. Oh, just a little bit more to the side there. Let me pick up all of this. Um, more movement speed. Yeah, that also removes it from the table. Move down here. Hello, Mr. Skeleton. You should have an ability pickup for me. Ooh, actually... Uh, we're not doing that much damage right now. <laughs> we might need more damage. You know what? I'm going to start taking force. Um, it's going to give my main attack penetration. And it's going to give uh, the rift a little bit more duration. Which is not really useful. But... It might also give those little blades duration, which would be very useful. So we'll take it. I do think I, I'm still very upset um, about the force change. I, I really wish that they wouldn't have done it before improving the, um, the visual... What can I say? The visual information of, of, uh, of the game. Like, you, you just... Or the clarity, I think, is a better word for it. Like, you just cannot check what it does, which is just garbage. That's garbage design. There's more... That's more damage here. I will take it. It's going to bump down my area, but I will take it. I need more damage. I don't think I'll ever be able to, like, one-shot some of these elites. But I do want to try. I know you can with the Cleric. I did a run with the cleric where I was one one to two shotting elites, <laughs> but uh, the cleric that's another build that's actually uh, or another character that's very broken. They just have over one thousand main weapon damage f at level one. Very very fun to play. I guess I could pick this up for the experience. Yeah, get rid of that. Yes. Okay, we did hit. Agony 3, I'll take damage. That removes it from the table as well. But I'm not too happy with my damage right now. Mmm, yeah, I need more. <laughs> I need more, more, more damage. Pop these guys. Uh, yeah, more force. That's gonna be good. Hopefully. Yeah, look at... I, I do feel like... It is upgrading those. <gasps> no, you gave me Kuggle Blitz again, you piece of shit game. No. That's not what I wanted. I guess I could have re-rolled. Oh, I'm stupid. Yeah. I'm so stupid, I could have re-rolled. I forgot that you can re-roll abilities. Oh. <laughs> I don't even know why. Why did I forget that? Oh my god. Although, look at this. <laughs> it's lagging my game. Oh my god, it's actually lagging my game. Yeah, every time I step on it, my, my game kind of gets a little bit of, of lag. Also, I just realized this is probably going to look horrible on YouTube. Just because of the compression rate. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> This is lagging my game. Look at the, what the fuck. We are only agony level three right now, which is not good. We have twelve minutes. Ooh. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, more area. Bop. <laughs> 
I love it. I love seeing that. Ooh, I almost run into that. Uh oh, I'm getting real low. Okay, that's a that's a boss up there. Oh my goodness, I have to take the health. I mean, I'll probably still die, but it's gonna keep me alive a little bit longer, so that hopefully I can regen. It seems like I am. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's my upgrade. That's my upgrade. But it's on the goo. Oh my god, come on. Come on. Get rid of that goo. Oh, I died. I don't even know what I got hit by. Oh my god. I... I cannot see any... Oh, there it is. Okay, it's over. Yeah, look at that. They're moving towards me. And, uh... They move, they move faster if you have uh, movement speed. So that's why I took so much movement speed. So now I can just AFK here. Um, there we go. <laughs> we got the build going. I wish I would... Oh, look. There's a boss right there. I think that's a boss. He's just teleport. Yeah, he's teleporting around. That's an elite, actually, not a boss. Uh, you know what? Yeah, more base health. It's not efficient, but that's okay. Yeah, we are now fully a well, not fully AFK since I do have to move around to pick up experience. But I think I think I can call it AF AFK. Uh, we'll get up. You know what? Frost Avalanche. I'm already stacking a lot of frost, so I'll take Frost Avalanche. Yep. Why not? We got all of the upgrades we wanted, so I don't really care now. I just gotta sit here for uh, ten minutes. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Wow. Beautiful. Yeah, that's why I took the um, Hunter's Garb. Because 30% damage for standing still is just so good. In the early game, it's pretty much useless because you have to run around the map to pick up abilities. But once you get to the middle game, late game, it's good. It's real good. Probably best in slot, to be honest. Pick all of this up. Uh, multi-strike and attack speed. I'm actually going to wait on that. I'd rather have a damage one. Uh, please stop giving me that. Pick all of this up. Okay, there is another boss. So hopefully he drops an ability. So we can upgrade our frost. Or our avalanche, I think it's called. Uh, yeah, Frost Avalanche. Come on. Give me the ability. Oh, a red chest. I don't think I have any item rerolls left. Oh my god, what is going on? Oh! <laughs> I the, Okay, I, I got a, a an item buff. That's why. That's why I was going crazy. Okay, uh, let's pick that up. Oh, more attack speed. Yeah, man. So I wonder, like, mm, I wonder how I could get more attack speed on this. Hmm. I'm sure there is some, like, min-max way to make this even faster to get attack speed. I'd be really interested to see that. Just have it constantly e exploding. Uh, oh my god, it's lagging my game. It's just a blue, <laughs> just a blue screen. Oh, there it is. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, it's so satisfying to get like a stupid build going. It, it truly is. And it might sound stu- Oh, there it is. Plus 40% damage. I'm going to double that. So that's 80% it. Now I do lose 40% area. Okay, hold on. I'm not going to double this one. I am going to take it, but I'm not going to double it. And I will take the next one, which should give me 40%, no, 20% area. And then I'll double it for 40% area. I think that's the play. 
Oh my lord. Uh oh, I have no more rerolls. Wait, so then what do I do here? I don't want anything here. Why can't I skip? Oh, uh, I wish you could skip. Oh no, I mean I Well, I'll take crit chance. That's fine. Yeah, that's too bad. That that would, I, I don't think I need the crit chance. I feel like that was a level up that was just kind of wasted on a stat that I don't care about, but uh, it's fine. Uh, what are we at? Okay, that's Agony 4. I think I can get to 5. Yeah, I think I can get to 5. And as far as I know, 5 is the limit. Oh my god, there's a magnet on the screen. I didn't even see it. Yeah, there is a base rift. Yes! Plus 20% area. I doubled that. And damage. So that's 40% area, 40% damage. And, hold on. More shockwaves. Yep. I'm going to memorize that one. Double this one. And we are... Go oh my god, look at this. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, I got the magnet. Good. Oh, right. I should... I'm going to try to remember to show... How they okay? I'm gonna do it right now. So, if I get behind this guy, it should proc, right? Oh, hold on, hold on. Uh, I got a position. I'm gonna run away. Okay, into this guy. Yeah, look at that. They're proccing on him. I'm not proccing them. That has to be a bug. I th well, maybe it's not a bug. I'm not sure, but I feel like it probably is. Like, look at that. It's gonna pop there. Yeah, the elite is popping the the rifts. Oh my goodness, this is so stupid. <laughs> Good, that's another level up. Thank you. Up to 83. We might even hit level 100 here. Uh, frost chance. Yeah, more frost. Mm. Yeah, I think I'll, I'll just stand still. I'll stand still until I get... Agony 5, and uh, probably make a cut, because there's not going to be too much, really. Nothing interesting happening. So I'll see you at uh, Agony 5. Okay, uh, <laughs> I haven't hit Agony 5 yet. There's 5 minutes left, but it's actually lagging my, like, it's lagging my game. Every, like, yeah, like, right there. It's actually lagging so hard. <laughs> uh, I hope it doesn't crash the game. I don't... <laughs> Like, look at this. Oh, my lord. <laughs> like, there is a noticeable, like, just stop there, like a stagger. Look at that. It just jumps. Oh. Uh, I might even call this one the forbidden build. Actually, no, it's it's not quite on the level of the forbidden build from PoE, but... Which, by the way, if you haven't seen that video, I highly suggest you go watch the forbidden builds of PoE. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, you know what it would be kind of interesting to try and replicate that in Halls of Torment just a build that the whole purpose of the build is to crash the game <laughs> oh that would actually be really funny I don't know how I mean, this would be probably one of the few ways to do it just overload the graphics card cause it to break uh, come on, give me, give me five. Give me agony five, please. I have the damage. I just need. You know, actually, that's one of the things that I don't like about the agony system. I think it's too. What can I say? It's too dependent on DPS. I almost wish that it was more dependent on kills rather than DPS. And the reason the reason why that distinction is important is because there are some enemies uh in this in this level I I don't think that uh they spawn but in the bridge and uh in the frosted caverns especially there are enemies 
that have a flat amount of block chance. So even if you have high DPS, they just have, as far as I'm aware, a flat percent chance to block. Um, I've I've played with the cleric in the in, in the frosted caverns, and the cleric can get over one thousand uh, main weapon damage. And in order to in order to block uh, an attack, I believe you need to have. I think it's almost four times, four times the amount of the of of block power as the attack you're taking. So either those mobs have over four thousand uh, uh, block, or they just have a flat amount, which I think is what, what it actually is. They just have a flat amount to block, which is just stupid. And uh, it's it's quite a lot of those mobs as well. So I wish it was tied to like kills, just just have breakpoints and kills that get you agony. And e even if you like, it becomes unmanageable. I think that's part of that's part of the challenge of agony. That that you leveled up too fast, you didn't you didn't manage your damage, things like that. I I think it would be much better than what it is right now. Because in the frosted caverns, you can get to to agony five probably i'm sure people have done it but it, it's it's like for the average player i would say it's probably like impossible even agony three i've i've seen a couple of discussions about agony three for the achievements on the um uh on the norsemen as well as the um the beast huntress like i think a lot of people are having trouble getting even to three so they, they, they got to rework Agony or actually if they don't want to rework Agony, just just change the caverns. They're, they're very on balance. But enough complaining because we're about to hit five. We're about to hit five right now. Uh, I guess it doesn't really matter what we get. We'll get crit bonus, flat crit bonus. We're about to hit Agony level 5, please, I have 1 minute 38 seconds, surely I hit it, right? Please don't blue ball me, please, I beg you. Oh, let's pick up some just, some last experience, maybe just a little bit of extra damage to push me over the edge. Please, please give it to me. Uh, okay, percent crit bonus, sure, why not? Please, please, please give it to me. One minute. Okay, this guy should give it to me. Oh my god. Oh, I just get... Ah, uh, you know what? I'll go with Dragon's Breath. And, oh, I just realized I never did the quest to kill the boss. I think I can still do it. Uh, but it's just going to take a very long time. And I might die also. <laughs> Come on, hit five. How am I not at five right now? L look at the bar. Oh, there it is. Oh, yes. Oh, I can hit five. Oh, and that's the max. Ooh, that feels good. And look at the build. It's lagging out my game. My computer fans are going uh, pretty ham right now, so that's cool. And... Uh, we're getting a lot of kills. What's the DPS on this, actually? Arcane Rift, 71k DPS. It's done 26 million damage. It's actually not that much. Uh, 26 million damage. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, that's okay. <laughs> it's not supposed to be a high damage build, really. That, that wasn't really my goal. It was just to make an AFK auto bomber build, which is uh, which is what I've done here. Look at that! Whoa! I, I actually, I just realized something. This build is so horrible when it comes to visual, like to what you can see on the screen. That I might die just from my own attacks. Oh my god! I gotta like squint at my screen. Oh, uh, where? Oh my God! 
Yeah, I'm doing zero damage to him because I don't have the item. Oh, and he still has a second phase too. Oh my god. Yeah, I don't know about this one. I think I should just, yeah, I think I should just give up. Because that's, that's only half health. Yeah, I think I'll just let him kill him here. I don't want to bother. There it is, 56 million damage. That's pretty good. Where did the other, well, yeah, I guess basic attack was 8, 7. Okay, so we had a lot of different damage from, from other sources. But 27 million with Arcane Rift. 5. 5 Agony. Absolutely beautiful. There it is. Thanks for watching.